Okay, hi YouTube. Uh, this is uh, DJ Advice Morrow, DJ Morrow, or DJ Advice, whatever you want to call me. Um, anyway, I'm just showing you a, a example of what I use for my gigs. Real simple. Even the table's simple. It's just uh, one of these uh, uh, Rubbermaid that I painted, and I just have like a little drape around it. <coughs> it covers all the all the amps and all that stuff. Now what I'm using right now are, are Bose uh, monitor speakers. You see on both sides. And there's my cat. This is uh, my cat and this is, I don't call it the dungeon like, uh, I don't know, what do I call it? It's still in progress. I'm, I'm, I just put drywall in the ceiling. <laughs> anyway, uh, there's my cat. She's going to be bugging me. I should put her away. But anyway, this is a uh, virtual DJ. 6.1 right here and that's just a skin I have you can put it whatever you want you can make it look the way you want to make it look uh, the beauty of uh, virtual DJ is that you could do that that's uh, up to you you have a choice of hundreds uh, thousands I don't know probably more than I'm just exaggerating here but you have a plenty of skins you can use it whatever suits your need and you can map it any way you want on this controller or whatever controller you have if just as long as it you can control it with um, a Denon unit, of, uh, you can control it with a Pioneer unit. There's a lot of units out there. Um, Paul, is, uh, DJ Paul, uh, is controlling it with, uh, I, I think, a Pioneers. But you can map it out any way you want. There's a lot of configurations. But I'm going to show you the beauty of both uh, and the reason why I prefer either. But I prefer this one, which is the RMX, the Hercules RMX. Um, and here's the box right there. There's the box. Uh, comes with a nice little case. There's a case. Um, I prefer this for weddings because it's a lot easier. Although I like taking both for a couple of reasons. Here you might need a hard drive if you don't have enough music or if you have enough uh, in your computer then that's sufficient. That's fine. Here it's a virtual, actually virtual when I say virtual uh, database, you can virtually get any music you want. Unlike LimeWire or you know all the other stuff, you're not actually downloading them. It's a virtual kind of uh, on-demand kind of thing. I talked about it earlier. Uh, that's the cool thing about um, uh, this. You know, I basically was Serato, and I still love Serato, but I'm not going to say that uh, I would use it, uh, uh, particularly at a wedding. Uh, where that's my main business is wedding. But anyway, I'm going to show you a little bit about that. Um, hopefully this video is coming in clear. We'll see something's going on with it. But uh, it's probably the something. But anyway, I want to show you some features in just a minute. But this is just a video to kind of show you the layout. Um, you know, if you're familiar with Virtual DJ with RMX, you can just basically, uh, let's say like this is the one Charleston song that somebody wanted, and uh, you just basically load it here. Let's press it, and it loads it uh, virtually on there. You can scroll. I mean, it gives you a lot of nice features. I would recommend, though, uh, if you're using a lot of bass, make sure you just put a little rubber mat around under the bottom. Could be one of these uh, like rubber mats, like like for uh, an auto zone where you can buy it. Just put it underneath. That'll dampen it because it these. If you're gonna mix or scratch with them, they do uh, they they do have feedback or uh, reverberation like a needle does on a, a turntable. But if you don't take the scratch mode out, and it'll be a lot more stable. That's if you want to mix. I, I mean, it's really entirely up to you. On this, <laughs> uh, there's a lot of good things about it, and that's what I'm gonna be talking about uh, in a little while. But that's just this is a video kind of introduce uh, you to both. Uh, this is uh, the Hercules RMX, which a lot of people already know about. I mean, it's been around for uh, a couple of, I'm going to say about a year or so. Um, I'm sure there'll be something better. Uh, but I, right now, I really believe that this is a way to go for some DJs. Not every DJ will want to go this route, but I really like it a lot. I mean, I used to use uh, basically just... Uh, 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 CDs in the beginning and now I'm using mp3s uh, full on board uh, you know DJ because after all at a wedding if you think about it you, which the biggest attribute isn't the music because the music is part of the wedding 
but you your voice so your voice is uh, really a big part as coordinator uh, slash entertainment coordinator you you are uh, using your voice quite a bit to introduce uh, the first dance the uh, toast all kinds of things at a wedding uh, but I just want to introduce you to that because it's a really cool item uh, you can use it with any kind of uh, uh, you know system you want uh, L1 Bose if you want for those ladies out there Mackie uh, speakers uh, you know powered speakers uh, for those people that want some uh, bass you know whatever whatever really whatever you want to use but you can hook it up to that and you can use both and I'll, I'm going to give you a reason why you you should consider both uh, and for the Hercules owners you can upgrade to the uh, 6.1 and it's not going to cost you an arm and a leg. But anyway, uh, more about that in just a little while on my next video. I just don't want uh, to run out of time here. So anyway, uh, uh, just uh, you know, just consider it. Just something to let you know. Uh, I there is a lot of things that I'm still learning on it. So I just wanted to kind of show you. Uh, that's the RMX. That's Virtual DJ 6.1. And there's a lot of cool things about it. So I'll tell you in just a second.